Hey guys, what's going on? It's Yo Auntie, and welcome to another episode of Ask Yo Auntie. So I made a post tonight on Instagram uh, asking for you guys to ask me some questions, and let's see what we got. So at the moment, 331 comments. I'm just gonna kind of fly through, grab some good ones, grab some random ones. So first off, we have GS Mikazi K33. What is your job? I'm a retail store manager of a small retail store in Boston. Brady Trevaro asks, what is your favorite pizza topping? I gotta go, you know, uh, meat lovers. You know, you throw on sausage, pepperoni, bacon, sold. Kevgar10 asks, can you make workout slash gym vlogs? Maybe, we'll see. You know, I don't wanna really bring the camera into the gym and freak anyone out in the gym like talking in front of the camera or I also don't want to come off as like be like oh look at me I can lift all this weight uh, so if, at the moment I think I might hold off on that Roger all day 97 asks Spurs or Heat? Heat. Ethany 9696 asks when did you start collecting sneakers? I'm not sure when I started collecting I know I've always loved sneakers Growing up as a kid, one of my favorite athletes was Ken Griffey Jr. And what happens as a kid, when you look up, uh, look up to an athlete, you, you know, you want to emulate them. You know, Jordan, we all love Jordan as kids, so we want to wear his sneakers. For me, I've always been into athletes. I'm a huge sports fan, so I always was into sneakers because of the athletes. So everyone always asks, well, what shoe got me started? There was never one specific shoe. It was always me looking up to an athlete and then I'd kind of look to see what type of shoes they'd wear. But I've always liked shoes. I always will like shoes. Uh, I, don't, I don't consider myself a collector because I think a, a collector keeps things like for presentation and doesn't wear them, keeps them in display. I, I will never own a pair of shoes that will ever stay DS. I only have a few pairs left that I need to un-DS. I will always wear all my shoes, and if I if they're just going to be a collector's piece, then it's got to be a very special shoe. But I don't really consider this a collection. You know, it's almost like you know you, people that buy a lot of T-shirts. Is that a T-shirt collection, or is it just a bunch of T-shirts they own? Wade Black Lidge asked, "Do you have a monthly budget that holds you back from copying everything you want?" That, that's a good question. I'm really trying to pick and choose what sneakers I'm going to get next. I feel like as, you know, sneakerheads, we all tend to just want to cop everything and it's hard to hold back because there's been a lot of great shoes releasing. So going forward, I want my pickups to be special. I don't want to be the person that's like, oh, I copped, you know, 25 kicks this week and just because like going forward I'm, I'm gonna really focus on on what kicks I buy but I don't really set a limit if six must-haves release in two weeks then I'm, I'm gonna buy them. B4 underscore long says ask Chipotle or McDonald's that's tough I mean Chipotle is excellent but McDonald's it's like it's McDonald's. Jason Lima 9780 says, does your family and friends give you a hard time because of all the shoes you have? I know mine do. Uh, they don't actually give me a hard time. They more just, you know, want me to be cautious with, with my spending, you know, because it, it's, it's clear it can become a little uh, excessive. So as long as they know I'm being smart about it, they're, they're actually pr pretty supportive of me. Spencer Levis Levescu asks, free iced coffee for life? or a pair of any DS pair you want for free? Excellent question. I'm going iced coffee for life because in the long run, one, I drink a lot of coffee and spend a lot of money on coffee. Two, I mean, free coffee, I'll be, I'll be like running like on energy all day. I'll, I'll just, I'll get an IV and I'll just hook up the coffee right into my arm and I'll, I'll be good to go. So, and I'm dr I'll be drinking coffee till I'm 90. Well, may maybe not. It, Drinking coffee at a very old age may not be that good for, for the old ticker. Marvelous Westy asks, favorite movie? It, it's so tough. So there's always like the small no-name movies I really like, then the more mainstream movies that I think most people like, like Shawshank Redemption, great movie. I love, but I would say like uh, Adaptation's a good movie. In Bruges, I like Inglorious Bastards. I thought that was a great movie. The Machinist is a good movie, but I, I like a lot of the classics that everyone, everyone you know, tends to like as well. Freddy TV asks, would you quit buying kicks if your significant other asked you to? Yes. 
Frankly, Miss Kelly asks, if you had to wear Nike SBs or New Balances your whole life, which one would you wear? I would actually go with New Balances on that one. DTB underscore LS1 asks, where do you cop your camo shorts? Actually, you can grab them at like Old Navy, American Eagle, Hollister, Target, maybe The Gap. You know, most, most uh, you know, retail stores will have those. Kevin underscore Tillery 34 asks, what is your favorite LeBron 10 to release? Right now, the four I have, I really like Corks, LeBron 10 Elite Homes, Dolphins, and Volts. Ant 8N underscore M asks, is Nike being a dead horse with their foams? I think so. I know for me, I'm kind of over foams. I think I'm done with foams just because the colorway is getting a little played out. It, it almost starting to feel like the kid's designing them. It's like they're putting wacky stuff on them and I'm just kind of over the foam posit at the moment. Mr. CJ Yokum81 asks, 11 loads or black grape fives? I'm actually going for the black grape fives. I may have to pass on the 11 lows. It's a really nice shoe. I really like it, but like I said, I've got to start uh, being more selective and really buying truly what, you know, the sneaker I really want. I am Dylan asks, what's the shoe that you want from a release this year? I really wanted the Royal Ones. I had a chance to get them and I thought, I said, no, don't, uh, you know, I'll just grab them online. You don't have to look out for me just because I, I, I feel bad asking people sometimes. I don't like to reach out and be like, hey, can you help me out? Like, I like to try to get it myself. Unfortunately, in that situation, I, I lost B. However, I heard the bread slash band ones are coming out in the fall. Really want those. JGP92 asks, best place to get some new balances? Check Zappos. They actually have uh, new balances and they put them on sale uh, a lot, actually. Matteo L. Cicchiano asks, why do you look like Bradley Cooper? I don't think I do, but I'll take that as a compliment. This guy's killing it. All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up for this episode of Ask You Ante. There were a lot of questions. I wish I could get to them all. I'm going to try to do these more often so I can hit on some of these questions. And also the people that I didn't see your questions, the Instagram thing kind of, it only allows me to see 150 comments. So I missed a bunch. So I apologize about that. I'll figure out a better way to do this so I can see all comments. But as always, guys, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. And I'll talk to you guys really soon. Take care. Peace.